Hello beautiful people, how are you? This is Tamasha with Mother Earth's Healing TV and today's video is about how to live that jar life. And I know you're like, jar life? What is she talking about? I'm talking about mason jars because I am in the process of trying to rid my home of plastic storage because it's just not good for us. The BPA free that you see on a lot of plastic wear, that's the thing we want to avoid. What happens is over time it seeps into our food, especially if you are using the microwave to warm your food up, it, it makes it even worse. And it's affecting our reproductive system and it's mimicking the, um, the estrogen hormone in women and it's just all around not good for us. So I have started using mason jars for everything. You can store pasta, rice, flour in mason jars. You can store lettuce, onions, whatever. You can store everything in mason jars. And today is one of many videos showing you foods that you can do. And today we're making a burrito jar, which is one of my favorite things to make. I make it for my son, he always wants it. So uh, let's go. We need a mason jar, and you can use any size you want. You might make it for yourself. You may be making some for your family, because the, the key is to make these and store them away if you need to. It's about convenience and time saving as well. So I have a, a two cup mason jar, and here is my salsa. I already have salsa in there, and you want to put the salsa in first, because what will happen is it will make everything soggy. So I have salsa. And then, see, here's my plate of veggies that I'm using. And as you can see, I have tomatoes, avocado, I have white onion, you can use green onion or red onion, and I have lettuce, and that is it. I'm gonna put some dressing on it as well. Oh, and I have rice, that's not it, <laughs> rice. And we're putting some black beans on it. I have brown rice, that's the healthiest rice. You could even use quinoa if you want and you can use kidney beans you know these kind of recipes are all up to you so basically what you do is put the salsa in first and then you put in your tomatoes and this is as far as the serving size that's also up to how much you want to put as well put the tomato and then I'm gonna put in a little bit of onion in there and this is like I said as much or as little as you want and then I will put in the black beans. And I'm probably gonna make a mess. So let's try and pull that over the plate. Black beans. And then I'm gonna put in a little bit of rice. Not too much rice. And then after you add your rice, pat that down a little bit. As you can see, I have my rice. And if you want to do more or less of the rice or the beans, do that. I'm going to put a little more rice. And then I'm going to put my avocado in there because you cannot have a burrito without <laughs> avocado. So I'm going to pack that down on top. And then put the rest of my avocado in there. See? And then what I will do now is put a little bit of this dressing that I made. I made some cilantro, avocado, and lime dressing. And I'm just gonna put a little bit of that on there. It's up to you, you don't have to add dressing, but when you have a salad, you know, why not? And then what happens is you put your lettuce on top. And that is your burrito jar, simple as that. Put the lid on it. And voila, there you have it. This is, see how easy and simple that was? And see what happens is you just store it in your refrigerator until you're ready to eat it. You can do the little eight ounce jars. This is a 16 ounce jar. And you can do bigger quart jars if you wanna make a family size. And you can travel with these in your lunch. So. The key is to get rid of the plastic and to show you how easy living that jar life can be. You can find mason jars everywhere. Just Google it. You'll get a gazillion options, even places to go in person. 
Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and let me know what you think about this video. And if you've tried this recipe or maybe added your own ingredients, don't forget to log on to the blog and read the negative effects of plastic and also to get the recipe and more salad recipe ideas on there. There's so many things you can do with this. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Mother Earth's Healing TV. I'm on Instagram and I'm on Facebook. Like, share, subscribe. Thank you. Until the next time.